guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Becky. I'm a fashion lifestyle blogger and I have the world's worst consistency on here. Uh, I swear that every time I come on and film a video, I declare that this is the time I'm gonna get my life together and I'm gonna post consistently and then um, see you in a few weeks, I guess. See you in a month, I don't know. Anyway, today is a no different. I, it is currently the, what is it, 30th? Yeah, the 30th of December. Uh, I am currently doing the whole new year, new me, get my shit together, ready for the new year kind of vibe. Hoping to be more consistent in the new year, but I am but a simple girl. Uh, my key skill in life is being very motivated and starting projects that can we take a moment for my heart jumper because I think this is the cutest jumper I have ever seen. Um, and with that, I have a very cute uh, haul for you today. So, I got some dresses from this brand called Hello Molly. I've never worked with Hello Molly, tried Hello Molly, anything like that before. So this was a very big treat. They did send these to me, but as you guys know, that doesn't mean that they get to tell me what to say. So I'm going to tell you what I think as usual but i thought that i would show you them i filmed a little like reel last week with them in so i'm gonna insert the clips from that uh so i'm gonna look different but was it last week or the week before it was last week no it was the week before because i filmed it and then we went to antwerp and i took my camera with me so i could send the videos to my phone and post them and then my camera battery died and i hadn't packed the charger so uh, I filmed them a while ago, but they haven't been posted yet. I picked out three really cute little dresses. Um, and the vibe of each dress is very, very different. So this one, the first one I'm going to show you, it's giving like Bali, poolside. It's gorgeous. It's a little bit sheer, but it is just stunning and I couldn't find my nipple covers so when I was filming so you will notice that I am covering my boobs in the video because like I said it's a little sheer you can see it there it's not like completely sheer like I would wear it with like pants and nipple covers uh but like I said couldn't find them so it's like a little mini dress it's quite floaty it's knitted uh, but the back is the dream here guys. This is a low back. It is Absolutely stunning with these crisscrosses you tie it yourself so you can make it tighter or looser And um, we've got these gorgeous little like kind of flare sleeves So beautiful um, it I do wish I'd gone up a size because I was very much envisaging envisaging envisioning envisioning slightly like more like skimming my body so you can kind of see the figure but not really kind of vibe and it's definitely a bit more fitted so i do think it fits how it's supposed to fit but for the fit that i wanted i wish i'd gone a size up um and i have it in a large which is an australian 12 and i believe that makes it a uk 12 as well because i think australian sizing is the same can't remember for sure i'm gonna correct myself on the screen if i'm wrong um but yeah, really, really cute. The prices on the Hello Molly site are slightly on the pricier side, but I think that for like the materials that you're getting, you'll see this especially with one of the later dresses that I'll show you. Um, I think that for the materials and the cut and the attention to detail that you're getting, I do think that it's worth that extra cost. But obviously if you're on a budget, no matter how nice it is, you can't spend the money. So. Just something to bear in mind, and I'll pop the prices of them on the screen as we're going through too. But listen, I am living for this. I cannot wait to be in a bikini somewhere with this dress this summer, next summer. Although we are going to be trying to be very well behaved with our money next year. So probably when I say a bikini somewhere, I do mean um, our balcony. But regardless, somewhere in the world, in this dress, with a bikini on top of it. Would I like that somewhere to be Bali? Yes. Did I just promise Ruben that I would be more sensible with my money? Also yes. The point being, 
the dress is a freaking dream look at that like look at the waist on it that's the thing as well like if you don't have much of a waist this is going to give you one because of the way that it's knitted it's obviously wider at the top floatier at the bottom so it definitely gives you that like hourglass cut without you needing to like have it yourself which i love i always find dresses with that cut that are already cut in to be so much more flattering they just have a nicer shape they like if you've got like food baby they don't cling so much because they're already built to have more space around your belly and gorgeous tan tan love that only thing i would say is like i said please remember that it is like a sheer ish design bear that in mind two more one is green and one is black so let's go green next this is the one that i was saying oh dropped it this is the one that i was saying that you can really really see like the attention to detail and how it's like worth its money because I've seen hundreds of dresses like this in my life and the problem is that a dress like this just doesn't work if you haven't put the time and the effort and the materials into a nice cut, a nice, uh, you know, making sure the proportions are balanced, um, making sure that the material is sturdy enough because like here you're going to pull these straps quite tight. And I've had dresses like this where that strap is just torn straight off the front. Side note, uh, this would make such a stunning bridesmaid dress for like a fairy wedding vibe um, or like a Christmas wedding. Um, so anyway, it's this at the front. Uh, you've got that really deep V. It does go like below your boob kind of thing. Like it's quite deep. And then you've got this floaty tulle kind of skirt. So you've got, I think it's two layers of tulle here. So is tulle the name of the material or the shape? I don't know. That, the mesh thing. There's two layers of that. And then underneath that, in here somewhere, you also have this lovely like satiny skirt. It looks heavy, but it's not. Sometimes these can be quite heavy, but this is more of a floaty one. Uh, but then obviously you get that nice poofy shape from the mesh super floaty really 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 pretty and then you guys know your girl loves a back detail so it goes even lower at the back so it kind of goes to like the small of your back like i wouldn't say it goes lower than that it goes like to that and then you have these like strings that you tie up that's how you get that nice like at the front this is so so pretty like if you're looking for a prom if you're looking for like a bridesmaid kind of dress if you're looking for something just to wear to a nice dinner because they do have some other colors that are a little bit more wearable as well you could wear it to dinner you could wear it to a party whatever i mean you could wear it green anyway but i'm a bit more of a like subtle person like i like to wear very muted colors so if i'm gonna wear something like green it's got to be like a special occasion um but anyway i'm bubbling again freaking gorgeous i got this one in a large as well i think i got all three in a large for this one i could have probably gone a size down i think um like it does fit well um but if i wanted to i could have gone a size down so if you're between sizes i would say go with the smaller one but if you're like i don't know you're always a 12 for instance go with the 12 um and just look at the freaking like emerald green that jewel color stunning so so pretty oh also it came in this like gorgeous box with like the tissue wrapping i love it when brands go that little bit extra to do that especially when you've spent a little bit more money on something like nothing irks me more than when you order something that's like really exp nothing irks me more than when you order something that's kind of expensive um and they don't like wrap it nicely and it comes and it's all like screwed up or you know it's there's just no effort at all and i'm just like you you could have tried guys i'm still kind of in the christmas mood you know we bought mulled wine cordial today and i've just made it with warm water and i'm like this is so good it's reminding me of the christmas markets in prague it's making me want to be all festive again and I thought I was done with that like I've been complaining about how much space the tree is taking up and saying how I'm ready to take the tree down and I'm done and now I'm a bit like mm, maybe a little bit more anyway third up 
is this like longer knitted dress. This is really, really cute. Um, I think that I picked out a different dress and it was out of stock. So they sent this one because it was really similar. But I have to show you the other one as well because it was so gorgeous. It was like, um, had like pearl detailing on it. It was so, so pretty. So I'll put a screenshot of that one in too. Just so you can see it because, mwah. Um, but this one is also gorgeous. It's just a little bit of a different vibe. So this is a like midi, midi dress. As you can see there, wow, this is the, really the best way to show off a dress, Rebecca, well done. Mini dress, knitted, but it's that kind of like tight, um, elastic-y kind of knitted that gives that very sculpting kind of effect. Very much reminds me of the Skims dress material, if you get the vibe that I'm kind of talking about there. Uh, really, really pretty. And then again, we've got this lovely like deep V at the front and these strings. That you, it kind of crisscrosses around your boobs, wrap it around your waist, give it a nice tie in the waist. Beautiful. Uh, really, really cute on. I really liked it. No space, by the way, actually. Um, obviously, I had my breast reduction last year, so I'm very much still on that like no bra vibe, and I'm loving that. But just to kind of clarify, of these three dresses, you couldn't wear a bra with any of them, I think. Maybe this one, actually. Maybe, you know, those ones that are quite low. Maybe, but I don't think so. Yeah, so that's just something to bear in mind. I don't mind it. This one and the green one definitely have enough support. I would say you don't really need a bra unless you have very large boobs. The first one, there's no support either. Um, so just something to bear in mind but yeah this one is super cute i would say this one's a really really nice choice for like a date night you want to look sexy but you want to look classy and you want to maybe show off the girls a little bit not sure it's something i would wear like to dinner with the in-laws or something like that it's a bit bit much for that um but if you want something that's kind of sexy so classy, definitely a 10 out of 10. Um, yeah, so like I said, they are all slightly on that pricier side, but I would also say that I think they all are quite fairly priced for the materials and the quality that you're getting. Like you're definitely getting a higher quality product here. So I do think that with that in mind, the pricing is quite reasonable. The, the, like I said, the cuts of them, the materials, really, really pretty. So, uh, I would definitely have to recommend Hello Molly, actually. I was a little bit skeptical because, like I said, I'd never tried them before and I don't think I'd actually heard of them um, until they got in touch asking about um, sending some items over. So I was a little bit skeptical at the price point, whether it, they would kind of be worth it. Because I think there are a lot of shops online that just rely on their designs being pretty enough that they can charge a lot. But then the quality doesn't quite warrant it. But actually I was really pleasantly surprised that I think that these ones really were. Um, so yeah. I'm going to put some links to them in the description box below. So if you want to have a look then you can have a look there. Um... And yeah, let me know in the comments which was your favourite dress. It's my birthday in February and obviously it's Valentine's Day and it's also going to be Ruben and I's first anniversary. So I am very much on the hunt for all of the gorgeous dresses, dinner dresses, anything like that. So let me know any other brands that you would like me to review. You know, give me excuses to spend money. Anyway, I'm gonna leave you all to your days. Thank you so much for spending your time with me. I hope that you loved the video as much as I love these dresses and I hope that I will see you all in my next video. Bye. You said you like a smart girl. Need one to call you out.